Oh my God! <gasps> no! No! Hold up. Hey guys, welcome back to Punchinella Games. I am Punch, aka Brie, aka Byt, and today we're back with Forms Divine episode four. Um, on this episode, we're gonna age Amari up to a child. I've pretty much exercised all of my toddler options, and quite frankly, I'm just getting a little bored with him being a toddler. So we're gonna age him up to a kid today and you know see what else is going on with this divine family all right let's get it so we're here with faith right now his mom and she's up cooking breakfast um she's making a quick breakfast so everybody can just eat really quick and then i'm going to get this birthday party scheduled and we're gonna go ahead and age him up i'm ready for him to grow up i don't know about y'all but i am and everything keeps breaking and the house is a mess. I tried to clean up some of it, but yeah, I did what I could do. All right. I don't want no judgment. All right. So we're going to, let's go ahead and wait. it's still like super early. It's five in the morning. She woke up early. So I just had her go ahead and make some breakfast and actually I'm going to let her eat and then I'm going to have her bake a birthday cake and maybe make um, some food for them to take, like pizza or something. Okay, what's thinking? Like, I don't... I don't see anything that's thinking. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, it's The Sims. It could be a plate, like, sticking out the wall or something. I don't know. Anyway. All right, let's wake up. Let's wake up Miss Louise because, I mean, it's early and old people wake up early so she can get on up. And I'm going to go ahead and wake up Amir as well. But let me schedule this party before I forget. Okay. So he really supposed to go to school today. And he, go out, he get out of school at 2 o'clock. But... I'm, we're, we're skipping school today. <laughs> it's just preschool. Not that preschool isn't hella important because it is. I just don't care about it today. <laughs> All right. Birthday Sam Amari. And you know what? I want to do this with Faith. Hold on a second. Because I want her to invite her family and I don't know if they show up on Amir's friends list let's see here birthday Sam Amari all right guess so I'm not adding them to the guest list because I control them so they'll be there um but let's see so obviously Amir doesn't really know any kids so I'm just going to cl click on some random gigs so that we can actually have some at the party. Because, I mean, he doesn't know any at this point. So let's get these two little kids. Um, Bailey Moon. That's Thorn Bailey's child. That's fine. It should really be a bunch of kids because everybody was pregnant last time I played. Literally everybody in the darn neighborhood was pregnant. At the restaurant, everywhere. It's weird as heck. Um, let's do Piers and Evie. She's a toddler, but she can come. And, oh, this is one of Grandma's friends. These are both of her good friends, so I'm going to do both of them. This is a pretty Sam, and I haven't even touched her. Minus the fact she got those little things that go on your braids and your twist floating in the air above her head. All right, and Janine and Irvin, those are Faith's parents. So we're going to invite them too. Um, this is one of 
Miss Louie's friends as well. So I'm gonna invite him. She gotta have her friends. Cause you know, like when you go to a birthday party and it ain't nothing but kids, like, you know, sometimes you low key get bored, especially if you don't have kids. So yeah, so she's gonna invite some of her friends. So she's not like sitting over there with nothing to do. Um, Vivian, I think is one of her friends or I meant for her to be. So I'm gonna invite her. And I believe that is all I'm going to invite. Maybe some of their parents will come. Where is Eliza and Bob's children? Like, I know they got a lot of kids. But I don't see them on there. I would have invited them. All right, let me see. Okay, so... Sarah Scassolated on the pub. She came by the house before, so I'm just going to invite her. And I think Simon is her husband if he's not. I have no idea. Okay, hold on. I have no idea why all three of these are the same person. Like, he keeps spawning. I made one guy, dropped him in, and next thing I know, he was popping up everywhere. And I was like, how is he in all these different places? It's three different people. I have no idea how it happened. And I don't know if I should invite him because... He's the weed man, so moving on. I'm, I'm not going to invite him to the party. Oh, yeah, the little girl that always comes to see grandma. I'm going to invite her family. There we go. All right, so that's enough people. Yeah, 20 people, that's plenty enough. I don't even plan on cooking for that big of a group. Um, we're going to cook our own food. We don't need a mixologist. We don't need entertainment. All right, so I dropped this really cute kids birthday party venue I got it off the gallery right here so cute and I tried to keep I know I took a picture of the name because I always forget the name by the time I use it but this time I took a picture of it and it's made by Alice one Mm -hmm. I'm going to put her name on the, um, uh, when I edit it, I'll put her name on the screen. So you guys can go get it if you want to. I'm sorry. It's a beautiful venue. I'm sorry. I can't pronounce your name. Don't get mad. Okay, cool. All right. So let's see. Um, I'm going to do it at noon because I'm impatient. And all right. So she has just eaten. So let's go ahead and bake his cake while you're down here. Um, which cake do we want to give our little boy? Winter cake. It's not winter, but it's pretty. Strawberry cake. That could be good. Blue confetti cake. Blueberry cream crumpets. Um, I'm so indecisive, y'all. Gosh, I'm gonna do the blue confetti cake. Okay, so she can bake that. Please don't do that. Please grab a plate here. Thank you. And Miss Louise, what's going on? She's tense, festering bitterness from feeling bitter about someone nearby. Louise really cannot stand being around a Sam she has a grudge against. <gasps> Oh, okay, so her and Faith don't have the best relationship, and it's starting to show. So, yeah, it never, in my first gameplay, it never really showed up, but this time, it's, they're starting to have a little issue, and I think it's because when I was cleaning up the house, I'm glad we got to talk on the phone. Oh, she's talking to her mom. Um, when I was cleaning up the house, Faith said something to her that wasn't nice. Hey, repair this right quick, bruh. That wasn't really nice. And, excuse me, did he not, did, I said repair this. Um, sorry, Faith, Faith said something to her that she didn't like and they had a word or two and they already didn't like have the best relationship, so. All right, so I'm going to let little man sleep because I really don't have anything for him to do until his birthday. 
So let him sleep. Grandma, I wanted grandma to sell this painting because, oh, and we need to pay the bills. So let me let her come do that, which is gonna take away so much money. Hey babe, wait a minute. Hey babe, want to have a quick woohoo? Oh, if not, we could just relax together. Um, dang it, I would ordinarily accept this for her, but we're getting ready for the baby's birthday party. I can't leave. But babe, I didn't realize y'all was that tight. Look, their little relationship, it's like they have a relationship when I turn the game off. Because when I'm playing it, I don't really engage with them too much. But when I turn the game back on, yeah. Now it's babe. Oh, okay. Squeeze me. Grandma's like my new young adult. Like, she gets more play than the other Sims. What are you talking about? Crown Royal is getting on in years to poor old fella. Hope there's a few more pets left till the Reaper comes for a visit. Oh my goodness. Snowflake is getting on in years. The poor old fella. Hope to oh my gosh. Wait. My chickens are... My chickens getting old, y'all. Oh, I don't want them to die. That's gonna hurt my feelings right there. I wasn't prepared for them to die. Wait, why are you unhappy? Starving. Oh, crap. I love the chickens, but I don't feed them. <sighs> I gotta do better. But they're both getting old. Both of my chickens. My rooster is young. Probably because I had to buy him because I lost the first one, but still. Let's see. Yeah, so I'm going to let... No, come feed them. They're already about to die. Here goes Sheena. I heard, I heard you became friends with Camille Goldberg. She's chill as fark. <laughs> I can definitely see y'all getting along well. Yeah, okay, bye. Alrighty, let's see what we got. Okay, so he's awake. Uh-uh, no school today. Yep. He's missing a day. You can come potty. Where's his mom? Okay. I'm going to get out the omelet so that he can grab him a little plate. Did she ever make the cake or am I tripping? I don't recall. Girl, did she? Do y'all see a cake? I don't see it. I don't see a cake. Did she smooth? Just not make the cake? Okay, if I'm late to the birthday party because you didn't make this cake and this pizza, I'm going to be mad. I will delete you. I have no problem. And if I find the cake later, apologies to my digital friend Faith. Mm. Yeah, there's no cake in here. I didn't see one in her inventory. She didn't make it. Okay. Alright, girl. There's something that smells in the kitchen. I have no idea what it is. But I will have to figure it out at another time. <laughs> I don't... Oh, maybe it's the coffee or something. I don't know. I legit don't know. Okay, the coffee looks empty to me. I don't see anything in the microwave. Nothing in the refrigerator. Popcorn spoiled? No. I don't know. I don't know. And I just don't even care. Alright, so he needs a little bit of fun for a second. So he's going to ask his dad turn the TV on, please. 
Okay, so she's doing that. I'm gonna see if I can get Miss Louise to make the pizza. Okay, she made it. Thank you, girl. I appreciate that. Okay, bear with me because I do not remember which menu it is under. I believe. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe it's under cook. Oh, pizza rolls. That sounds pretty good. No. Okay. Um. Cook. This cook. Yeah, maybe it's under this cook. Okay. I have two cooks. I just realized. Anyway. Okay. Yeah. Here. Here's some pizza: Canadian bacon, chicken teriyaki, cheese, pepperoni. I could have sworn I downloaded some other pizza, but they may be in the custom side. Well, not a big deal. I'm not going to go through that whole menu right now. <laughs> let's just make, um, let's make a pepperoni, of course. Does everybody like pepperoni? And since she invited 10 people, I mean 20 people, we're going to make, oh my God, it's 10 already? Oh, hell. I don't know if I'm going to have time. No. Come back and I want you to cook the other pizza to save some time. Alright. Let's do Canadian bacon or cheese. Mm, I'll just do cheese because kids like cheese. She smoothed $152 for that pizza. My Lord in heaven. They smooth are ignoring me today, and I feel some type of way. Make the pizza. Thank you. And he's talking to his dad anyway. Needs amusement. I'm getting to it, little fellow. I'm getting to it. I was getting to it. Let's see. Chat with faith. Okay. But can you make that pizza though? Because I, I did it in this order for a reason. Because there's only one oven. Stop talking. You're running out of time. If they don't make this pizza before this birthday. Cooking is delectable. Does she like cooking? Sure. She didn't before. She thought she was too good to cook. Now look, she didn't came in here and got to her kneading of the dough already. And she just now getting to it. Look at here. Start soon. We got one hour. Let me put this pizza, I mean this cake in her inventory. The fact that neither pizza has made it into the oven is driving me crazy. Hurry up. I'm going to have to order the nasty pizza. And I don't even know if they'll bring it to me out. Oh, gosh. This is so frustrating. I can't even tell you. Now y'all starting at the same time and you only got one oven. Okay. Girl, bye. I already know. Just put it down on the counter. I don't care. So we're only going to get one pizza. One pizza. Oh, maybe we can get it done. Here, put it in the oven. Put it in the oven, girl. What you mean I can't click on it? Resume cheese pizza. Leave him alone and resume cheese pizza. Put it in the oven. Go, 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 go. Where did grandma just put the pizza? See, this is how come stuff be somewhere stinking and we don't know where it is. Just stuck the pizza up in the middle of the crackers. On the counter between the Crown Royal and the crackers. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we got seconds. Come on, pizza. Come on, pizza. Sit it down, sit it down, sit it down. Paw. Mm. Oh. I'm so mad right now. <laughs> I'm so mad. Golly. Literally a second. How annoying. All right, but anyway, let me show this little cute venue really quick. 
It's so cute. Wait, is this the only people that are coming? Oh, I didn't invite them, so they didn't show up. <laughs> Come on. Come on. All right. So, anyway, this is the venue. It's so cute. So, it has, like little sitting area here little area for them to make like sand castles a swing a slip and slide and then in the back there's the bathroom of course and then a little play area over here some pretty colorful trees and furniture yeah it's like a box of Crayolas and I love it okay so this is the inside so it's just like a big party room and the, mm -mm, he's not invited anyway. Um, so it's like a big party room and I got the little kitchen area. Oh, maybe I can make the pizza here. I forgot about that. Just found a solution to my anger. All right. And then over here, they got a little dance floor and it's a little sitting area. We can do a little buffet and this is where you put your cake and then upstairs. They got like this play area for the toddlers and a little story area. It's super cute. All these little toys and stuff. And this is a little bathroom. Isn't it cute? Everything is cute to me. But it's so cute. Alright. I know that was a terrible tour, but I want to get him aged up. I'm dying to see what he looks like. Okay. So, since we have a little time because everyone isn't here, I'm going to see if I can get her to do the cheese pizza here. And the cheese pizza at home we'll just eat because we're not wasting any food. Because I'm still glitched. Alright, so y'all come on in. Come on in, Amari. All right, let me change his outfit because he look like he going to bed at his baby's birthday party. What do we want him to wear? It's a party, so. And then grandma. Uh, dresser, change her outfit to um, which one is her party outfit? Okay. All right. So everybody's trickling in. I do not see her parents, though. I really wanted them to come. Maybe they will. All right. So Faith over here getting his pizza together. I'm going to turn on some music over here, so I have to make sure I pick the right option because I put my custom music in there and I don't want it to get my video taken down. <laughs> uh, let's turn the volume up. That's the only way to do it. Even at the baby's party. Hey, let's see who's coming. Okay, so this is grandma's friend. This is one of her friends. This is Vivian, I think. Yeah. Y'all look at grandma makeup, though. Where's she going, though, y'all? Wait, grandma, I want them to see your face. <laughs> Where's she going? <laughs> oh, grandma, man. grandma decked out. Looking cute. And it's a homegirl over here with her um, church hat on at the baby birthday party, her Easter hat. Grandma friends don't be playing. So let's see if she'll come over here and chat with her. Oh, there's her mom. Okay, so. Uh-uh, I didn't do that. Let me change her outfit. No, ma'am. I did not do that. I did this one. There we go. Mm. 
I'm gonna show y'all her when she stops making all those facial expressions. Okay, so this is Faith's mom. Isn't she gorgeous? Faith got young parents, by the way. Because Amir is actually... Why is Amir in his drawers? Bruh, what you doing? What are you doing? What are we doing? Excuse me. What are we doing? Not in front of the kids? Anyway, Faith got young parents is what I was trying to say. Because Amir's actually already like a full grown adult and Faith is a young adult. So her parents are still in their adult phase. Um, I don't know for how much longer. And this is her dad, but let me um, put on his outfit too really quick. There we go. So this is Faith's dad. And she obviously looks pretty much just like him. Yeah. She looks just like her dad. Alright. So. Uh-uh. Not the twerking at the baby birthday party. Don't get up now. I saw eating for two. <gasps> Oh my gosh wait dang look at her stomach what the wait a minute Jesus hold on last time I wait wait she just found out she pregnant at the back mm. oh my goodness everybody gets pregnant in here something's wrong Oh, God, I hope it's Amir's because on the last episode, she was in that bathroom with them other people. And now she's pregnant. I didn't even know she was pregnant. Oh, gosh, I'm sorry. I have, you, you know me. <laughs> I have to check. Oh, okay, thank God. Okay, so it is Amir's child. Thank goodness. And pregnant with one baby, one male baby. Okay, so she's having another boy. Wow. The timing, though. Like, he's grown up just in time. Her daddy is over here twerking on the floor. I'm so dead. So dead. Girl, did you forget you were cooking? Okay. I guess she didn't. All right, so I'm going to... I guess I can't. Okay, there we go. I want to put the pizza on the counter. <gasps> Y'all, I just lost the pizza. What'd I do with it? I'll be having the hardest time. Like, I'm not even kidding. Um, We couldn't get the first one off the, off the table, and now I can't. I done lost the other one just by moving it to the counter. Wow. I'm scared to move this one. Okay, so I'm not going to put the cake out just yet because I don't want them to tear into it before I get a chance to do his birthday. And let me check on everybody. Okay, so they're not hungry. Um, okay, so here's Grandma Little Friend. Mr. Stanley. <laughs> so let's let her come over here and greet her her friend um, let's give him a hug I'm so disappointed about losing that pizza oh well I'm gonna try not to harp on it all right, so Faith is hungry because she's eating for two, so I'm going to let her grab a slice really quick. I can't believe she's pregnant, though. I was just not prepared to have another person in the household. Where is Amir in his drawers? Amir. Oh, gosh. This man is so unpredictable. Okay. 
All right, so this is grandma's friend. This one. Okay, so these are the neighbors. So let me let him talk to the neighbor. And I think he actually needs to get to know her family because I don't think they really have like a relationship. So let's see what we got. Ask him how their day is. Be nice. I always forget about these goals. Make drinks. Have Sims listen to the stereo at the same time. Well, it's on. <laughs> Tell jokes. Blow out candles. Okay, well, we'll get the candle part. But to tell a joke. Um, let's see if Grandma can say something funny to her in that account. Mm -hmm. yeah, what a lifestyle gang thing has unlocked the close knit lifestyle. Okay. But yeah, so this is Faith's mom right here. Her mama fine. <laughs> All right, so that worked great. So I have them all listen to the radio. Grandma didn't change clothes. Grandma put on her swimsuit, y'all. Like where she was going. What is this? Oh, she fell. So watch another trip. <laughs> she fell, and she's dehydrated. All right, so let me let her get some water really quick because I don't want to lose Grandma some water is it inappropriate to brush your teeth in the sink I don't care brush your teeth <laughs> he didn't took it off again oh they're going out here to play oh, okay so he's not really in his drawers he's in his swim trunks okay I'm not judging as hard now Faith over here twerking with the baby in her stomach. Giddy. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. They kill me. I'm about to shake the baby smooth out. All right. Let's get these candles blowed out, shall we? Let's see, I think the cake is in face inventory. Let's put it in the center. All right, I'm pausing for just a second because I don't want them to bite into the cake before I get a chance to put the candles on. Actually, I'm gonna let him put the candles on because he's closer. Don't worry about that. Put the candles on the cake, please. That's real tacky. All right, so he's gonna go there. I'm gonna let Faith age up her baby. Can I change your clothes for picture purposes, please? Okay. Grandma! What in the world just happened? She dirty and got a mask on? What's going on? Okay, let me check on Faith. Okay, so she's getting her baby. Alright, Faith, let's blow out the candles. Bring him over. Oh gosh, this, this. Is that Erica about to? I'm probably dead wrong, but it reminds me of an old song. 
Maybe it's like sampled or something. Moving on. Come on, Faith. Oh, gosh. Okay, let me try a mirror. Let me see if he can help. Let's see if he can do it. Come on. Okay, so he worked. So let's just bring Faith over here. Sorry, screenshots. It's so cute. Look at his eyes. Okay, all right, all right, all right. How cute was that? Oh, look at his little suit. All right, Amari has aged up. So he was independent. Um, so let's see what we're going to make him. Creativity, mental motor, or social. I'm always terrible like this. I can never choose. And it frustrates me that I can't choose. Um, let's see. <laughs> let's do motor. Because I want him to be a little athlete. Let's make him active. Yeah. And sporty. Yeah, I'm creating my own little NBA player here. Or he could be a really good dancer. Let's see. Loves the outdoors. He could love the outdoors. Because he'll be working in the farm and stuff. Let's do that. Let's do that. I've never done that with a kid. So let's do that. Loves the outdoors. Alright. Let's see what our baby look like, y'all. Dang. He's sick already? What happened? He's sick already? Oh, he's dehydrated, having a good party, hands are dirty, and he needs to pee. Okay. Janine has sent Amari a gift. Yay, your grandma sent you a gift. Oh my god, I gotta I've got to edit her all the way through. That lipstick is no. Okay, so um he's not bad for Max's. <laughs> but um Y'all know what's up. I, I've, I've got to do something with the baby.
Okay, so had a complete makeover, but a vast improvement. Off camera, I'll go through all his outfits and, you know, clean them up and, you know, get him all ready for the game. But for now, got the new Amir. Super cute kid. Super cute kid. But anyway, so baby needs to potty really badly. So I'm going to send him up here to use the restroom. Oops, wrong person, child. Use the restroom. He's actually getting really tired too, so yeah. His mom is over here showing out. Like, really, really showing out. Oh my god! <gasps> no! No! Oh my gosh. Y'all, Miss Louise just died. Where is Amir? Amir, please come beg for your, oh my gosh. Plead for Louise, please plead for your mother. I cannot let her die. Put the god darn cake down and go plead for your mother. Gosh, this man over here eating cake. Eating cake. And his mom over here dying at her grandbaby's party. Did he say no? Come on, Grim Reaper. Luis Devine is truly gone. No. No, I cannot. I cannot. I cannot. Please. Please, 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 please. What do you mean they did it recently? I don't care. No. This is so unfair. And they won't even let me plead again. I'm not letting her die. I don't care what nobody say. I'm bringing her back to life. I'm bringing her back to life. I don't care. I'm not letting her die. Do not. No. What does it say? <gasps> no. I'm devastated. And her son over here dancing getting on my nerves oh my gosh y'all Miss Louise is gone from embarrassment and our son over here twerking his ass stop dancing it's not the time to dance Okay, so now I gotta figure out how to bring her back to life because I'm not letting her die. I'm, I refuse. I wait. I have spent too much time on her and this family to let her die of something as stupid as em as embarrassment. I refuse. I refuse. I'm about to get on Google and figure out what to do. I can't believe this lady just died on me. <sighs> okay, I'm going to end the let's play right there because. My main character has passed away at her grandson's birthday party. I can't take it. I simply can't take it. Um, yeah, so I got to get on Google and figure out how I can bring this woman back to life. Okay, I just can't let her die. I'm way too attached to my Sims. I can't handle it. Um, but again... <laughs>
Oh my gosh, she died. Ah. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. Of course, if you enjoyed the content, please like and please subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you'll know when a new episode is coming. And y'all have a really good day or night or morning whenever you're watching this. And pray for me because I... Uh, I'm, I, I don't know what to say. I always get left like this. What, what is up with that? I always get left at the end of the Let's Play completely in shock, devastated, where I have to walk away from the game, like, straight up. Like, I can't. Um, yeah. So, thanks. And I'll see you guys next time. All right? Bye. <laughs>